Hey guys, what is up? My name is Tiffany Jetter. Ugh, my hair. I hate my hair. Okay, anyway. My name is Tiffany Jetter. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Um, I just, me and my husband just came back from grocery shopping at Walmart, so I thought I would just show y'all um, what we got. So if you're interested, please keep watching. I think I'm going to kind of make this video like a vlog, like it won't be just my grocery haul I may organize my coffee mugs if you watched recently in a video I did declutter coffee mugs and I got rid of a lot but I need to put my coffee mugs actually up in the cabinet so I may film that but yeah if you are here for the video um, thank you and subscribe if you're new it would mean the world to me I'm almost at 1500 subscribers and what else um, give this video a like if you like me or my content. I really appreciate it. And let's just get into my Walmart haul. Okay, you guys, we're going to start over with the bread first. I picked up some Nature's Own Honey Wheat Bread. We love this one. And then my husband got the Sara Lee Golden Wheat Bread. This one's so good. Okay, so on to our other groceries. We got a 3 liter Coke. Um, these grilled cheese crackers I picked up for my daughter Penelope and her lunch. Um, we got two of these paper towels. They're 50 cents each. We got some bananas. I know they're not ripe yet. We got grapes. We love grapes. Grapes go by pretty fast. Um, we got some spaghetti noodles. And then I got this great value traditional pizza sauce. And... Oh, did I say pizza? I mean spaghetti. Um, and yeah, I didn't see the ragu kind that I usually get, so I just I'm hoping this will be good. Um, I got we got two bags of shrimp. They were out of shrimp the last few times we went, so I was sure to pick up some this time. Um, three pounds of ground beef. I am gonna be making chili in the near, near future, even though it's still hot outside. Um, I got this McCormick chili powder. I got corn to put in our chili. We got two packs of hot dog buns. Um, we got these weenies, 24 pack. Um, got these Tostino pizza rolls, pepperoni rolls. Um, I got this salad chopped salad kit, Market Side Family. This is so good, you guys. If you love salad, you are going to love this one. It's my second time now getting this one. It has bacon and sunflowers in it. Seeds is so good. Um, and then my husband picked up his lime juice. Um, we got some milk, a gallon of milk. We got Sunny Delight. We got lemonade. I picked up this chicken chicken fajita bowl. I love these things. And then we all, we went crazy on the ice cream. This Mexico brand is really, really good. My husband picked out the pecan one. Um, both the girls each got their own box of the Icy's. That way we don't have any fighting going on. And then my husband also got the coconut ones. Um, and then for myself, I picked up these drumsticks. They're great value, but they're really good. They taste just the same. And then picked out a, bo <laughs> a box of Fruity Pebbles. Um, they eat lunch and breakfast at school, but Fruity Pebbles is mainly for the weekends. Um, I did get four things of water, but the rest are still in the car. I was too tired to get everything out. And then I got some, we got a pack of Capri Suns, Fruit Punch, and we also got a 12 pack of Pepsi. So that is my haul, and this will last us about a week. Uh, we usually do grocery shopping for two weeks, but uh, things happen. We were eating out a lot, so this is just for one week. Hey guys, so I'm kind of having a stressful moment here. So came back, got my groceries in, did the haul that y'all just saw, and I am going crazy, you guys. I cannot find my car key anywhere. Usually, I mean, I do tend to lose my car key a lot, but usually I find it, like, right away. Like, not, it doesn't take long. It's been over an hour and a half, and I can't find my key. And it's really hard because my key's not on a keychain. It's just a key by itself. I check the trash. I check where I usually would put a key. I'm going crazy. 
but I hope I find it. Um, the only really place I, ha I haven't checked on the dogs yet at my mom's. So luckily her house isn't, it's a, it's a little over a mile. So, um, uh, I'll have to walk a little bit over a mile if I can't find the keys here in the next 30 minutes because it's kind of getting later. It's almost six o'clock. So yeah, I'm getting a workout because I can't find my keys. And so yeah, I'm stressing, but yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and organize and clean here in the kitchen. Hopefully I find it somewhere. Um, my kids are screaming, I do apologize. I'm gonna go ahead and clear out my little cabinet here and I'm gonna show y'all okay, what it's so going. this little cabinet here by the um, the refrigerator and you can tell it's miscellaneous like there's like medication um, salt sugar uh, sunflower kernels lunch boxes it's really disorganized and so like you saw the other day I decluttered my coffee these are all my coffee mugs I want to keep I had a lot more than this so I'm gonna put all of those coffee mugs here and organize them. And I apologize, my kids are screaming. Um, and yeah, that's what I'm gonna do now. So join me while I take care of this. You guys, I wanna show you how all the stuff that was up here, the cabinets are empty now. Um, Easter eggs, stuff just threw up there. This is like, did I put sugar in here? No. This is supposed to be for sugar. I got this um, from a thrift store and I haven't used it. Um, lots of medicines, as you can see. I think there's sugar in here. Yeah, that was, this is nice. This was my mom's. And. This thing is from Dollar Tree, and I have all these emergencies and some teas in there. So I'll have to find another spot for that. Um, yeah, chili sauce, all that stuff. Let me show you how nasty it is <laughs> in here. So this is like where all the medicines and stuff were. Um, very gross, very nasty. So I'm going to clean that out. I wish I had some cleaning wipes. Um, I'm going to have to clean that out. Um, let me see. Okay. So yeah, this is probably the worst one. The other two are not that bad. I do have some liners I got from Dollar Tree that I'm going to line these with. And then I'm going to put my coffee mugs up. on the bottom shelf that I'm prone to drink out of more often and then up here there's more like Halloween and fall I actually have room to get more fall I know I just decluttered to get more like fall cups I really don't have too many fall like pumpkin coffee cups so and then up on top are Christmas coffee cups so I think it looks a lot better Okay, guys, I found the perfect purpose for my new little Coca-Cola tin box that I just love. And I am keeping all of my coffee pods in there. It's the perfect fit. And I'm really digging it. Guess what, you guys? Um, um, it is now after 8 p.m. Still have not found my car key. I did walk over two miles to go feed the dogs because got to feed the dogs. They were happy to, happy to see me like usual. Um, and guess what I did? 
I did some stress eating. I've already eaten, here's my freezer. I've already gotten into these drumsticks. I just had two drumsticks. Yeah, that's my dinner. I am stressing. I'm gonna go look in the car again because I remember being out in my minivan right before I lost my key, so maybe I just left it in there. I don't know. I don't know how much it is for a new key, but I hope I can find it. Okay, we're going to take away something good from this situation of my car key missing. So I'm turning my apartment upside down, looking in every drawer, every crevice, every crack to look for this car key. And I'm, well, the one thing is I can get better organized because as you can tell, I just really let things go. I always, sometimes I leave it in this little pineapple dish, my car key, and obviously it's not there. Um, but I let this stuff go. I tell myself I won't. And then one thing leads to another and I just let it go. So I've got to get to organizing this. guys it is now Wednesday I think it's August 12th I don't know about the date actually um but so update we I still have not found the keys I've called a dealership and this is embarrassing but my car is so old because I have a 2005 minivan um that they don't carry the key anymore so I'm having to call locksmith and a lot of people are booked I don't know if it's because of what's been going on but they can't get to me within a week or two so that sucks i've looked everywhere for the key we just got done i honestly one of my kids penelope went got into the dumpster and we, we were desperate we were looking in the dumpster for the key like maybe i threw it out in the trash i don't know um we have just i've turned this place upside down looking for it i don't know maybe it'll pop up somewhere i've looked in the street i don't know
So, um, I and then when I did call the dealership, he I, I the van has a couple of recalls on it, which I knew of one of the recalls, but I didn't know it had two. And um, I haven't mentioned this before on my channel, but my the, this van is really old. Like I, I bought this van from somebody a couple of years ago on Facebook, which I was just in a desperate place. And I paid very little for it. And, of course, I've had to take it to the shop a lot. But I'm thinking of actually just getting a new minivan. And I like minivans because there's a lot of room. And plus, if you have kids. And I also, that's how I learned how to drive in a minivan. So, I just, I think I'm still going to stick with a minivan. But I'm maybe sh going car shopping for a new minivan I know that sounds crazy because I just lost my key, but I'm thinking maybe it's a sign just to get a new car because I was eventually going to get a new minivan anyway. Um, but yeah, so that's what's going on. I guess we do need to go a few places. Um, Target and Walmart, we either could catch the bus or catch an Uber. So one of those. Um, but yeah... Um, and oh, also my Wi-Fi is not really working here at the house. Um, so I'm not even able to watch too many people's YouTube videos or comment back or comment. Um, so if I am look like I'm not around Instagram or YouTube, that is the reason. It takes forever for an app to load. Because sometimes I delete my apps to make room for videos and pictures. And then so on and so on. So that is my deal. But I kind of got some perspective this morning because I live really close to a McDonald's and I walked over there to get onto McDonald's Wi-Fi. And I just realized that, you know, me missing my key, car key, isn't really something, isn't the biggest stressor in the world. Like there's so much more going on. There was a homeless lady actually wrapped up in a blanket on near McDonald's. And it just kind of stopped me in my tracks. Um, and it just, you know, there's bigger problems than losing your car key. Uh, some people don't even have a car, um, you know. So there's way bigger problems than having no internet and having no car. Or key to your car, whatever. So that is my dilemma. And I got some perspective. I don't know. I have no clue what I did with the key. I knew, I thought I carried it in the house yesterday. Um... But I, I don't know. I really don't know. Um, so that is my life. I'm not sure if... I guess, should I end the vlog here? Maybe I should. Because I've got to go over to my mom's and do stuff. So, yeah. So I guess I'll put this vlog up later today. Thank you so much for watching. Please pray for my family and me. I know that sounds stupid. But just for us, maybe we can find the key. Maybe it'll turn up somewhere. The only room I haven't really checked for the key is my kid's room. But... I didn't really even go into my kids' room yesterday, so I doubt the key is in there, but you never know. So, anyway, thank you so much for watching. I love you guys, and I'll see you next time. Bye!